who died? Like, it, before it was, like, all fire and, like, brimstone and, like, all kinds of, like, people were murdered everywhere and there was, like, a super hard fight, like, getting back here. This wasn't so bad with Calpurnia. Interesting. That is very, very interesting. I wonder why. I guess she only has the Venatori to command. I mean, she technically has the mages, but are they, like, like, the Templars were, like, under her sway, but I feel like the mages, or the Templars were, like, under the sway of the Red Lyrium, right? So they were, like, demented, but... But not... The mages are not, so... I, and I don't think... I don't know if they're affected by red lyrium in the same way that I mean what are, Oh okay. Okay. Speak to Leliana. Here we go. So it was an, under the inner circle. Interesting that Leliana didn't come out, but I do understand why she didn't also. She feels that when you talk to her, she feels like she has to stay like she needs to be the central point for her information otherwise she can't get a hold of it you know like she can't analyze it and make proper decisions interesting let's go talk to Leliana Interesting, interesting. Some decisions, Cole, Cole is like one of the few who seems to be really tied to some of these big decisions. Could I do you more? Ha <laughs> ha. Probably not. Okay. Um. I need to talk to you. you could at least bring me wine. Ha uh -huh. Loosens the tongue, so to speak. Let's spend time together. Let's do something interesting. More interesting than wandering the countryside killing random I know. strangers. Perish them. This castle of yours isn't exactly filled with diversions. But we can you could read me a story. <laughs> but we'll figure something out. Just like sit on the couch, read a book. Here is the request Harrit made. Should yeah. I wait for his reply? Why? Okay. Liliana. A thing happened. The reports from our agents at the shrine are intriguing. You were correct. Once Calpurnia becomes the vessel, I don't think she'll agree she with that at all because she was a slave. We are interrogating this magister Erastenes. We may learn more from him. Remind your agents. One careless move, and our resource could go up in smoke. Only my best are working on this, Inquisitor. Corypheus's notes mention a place where regret dwells. That is more than I a thought mystery. it was the Dumas shrine. Until the notes are deciphered, I intend rumors of the binding ritual to reach Calpurnia's ears. Um. Breaking her alliance with Corypheus can only help us. Breaching his sanctum might give Corypheus pause, yet Calpurnia is silent, as are her agents. We have given her something to think about. Okay. Let's talk to Lady Honor. They tell me you have a gift for shadows. Oh, and yeah! Things. When you put it that way, it makes it sound so elegant. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? Mysterious. Even romantic. Pretending it's something else sometimes makes it easier. As your spy master, may I say that I am pleased. <laughs> My agents appreciate that they can. Ah, that's true. Themselves. Have I ever talked about my friend? <laughs> he was an Antivan crow. He wasn't always good at it. We only met because he failed to kill a mark, but he made me laugh. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Sometimes I just want to land on Solus's head and see what happened. Probably not. I mean, nothing's going to happen, but that's okay. Whoa! Whoa! I was. 
Do you have a moment? Okay. Oh, was this, uh, I guess we didn't really talk much after the fade thing, or the thing with the spirit friend. What were you like? This weirds end. me out that this happens even if you rom like if you don't romance him like this Has seems very intimate. Changed you in any way? Your mind, your morals, your spirit. Uh. <laughs> if it had, do you really think I'd have noticed? <laughs> no, that's an excellent point. Why do you ask? You show a wisdom I have not seen since. Since my deepest journeys into the ancient memories. Since I was a young child you in freaking ancient El Arlathan. Um, I I'm gonna ask this. What have I done that's so surprising? You have shown subtlety in your actions, a wisdom that goes against everything I expected. If the Dalish could raise someone with a spirit like yours, have I misjudged them? Um. Well, uh, I can't ever remember. These are all good answers, I think, in their way, but... Uh, let's try this one. Most of the Dalish care more about impressing other hunters with a good shot, or talking about how awful humans are. There are only a few who seem to care about the old ways. Ah! Perhaps I suppose it must be. Most people act with so little understanding of the world. But not you. So what does this mean, Solus? It means that I respect you deeply, Inquisitor. Whoa! And I have disturbed you enough for one evening. And my mind is being changed about things, and I don't really want to bring this world to rot and ruin and fire and brimstone and make it all pretty again with freaking unhappiness. I thought it was a bit odd because he was just standing over in that corner and I wasn't sure... I wasn't sure what that was indicating. I mean, sometimes he stands over there, but he's usually standing with his arms crossed, or he's, like, looking at his desk or something, you know? He usually doesn't just stand there with his arms down. <laughs> That's weird, because I know all this stuff. I know stuff. It's because I watch him too much. Maybe we'll poke Josephine? Inquisitor. I was just inspecting. Oh boy. Foundation crack. Does it hurt? Mm -hmm. The anchor, that is. It's not pain. It's more like my nerves go on fire. It sounds most unpleasant. Oh, huh, yeah, okay. Interesting. I do wish we had more options to talk about the mark. I feel like that would be very painful. Apparently, I haven't talked to Josephine. No, oh, no, okay. But I figure we'll go do some thingies in here, and then see where we go from there. I want to go play with my new bow. <laughs> oh, I could open up the uh, Hissing Waste now and maybe go check out that bow. Or... I don't know, man. I don't know what I feel like doing. Influence! Excellent. Powerful price. Excellent. Thank you. Edgy dagger grip. That was a freaking Josephine's the service. quickest G's on that one. Gather coin. Securing a route. Don't really care about that yet. Christwood gathered herbs. Pack rider. Right. Oh, uh, we should do this. Yeah, we'll send Leliana to do time. that. Confront the mages in the rebel woods.
Okay. Colin, go! Walk. Go, Colin! Cool. I think I'm gonna go to Red Clip really quick to that book merchant. And freaking buy us some stuff for the for our mage friends. Oh, hinterlands. Red clip. Red clip. Maybe we'll go fight the dang damn dragon. Freaking heck. Dorian, Cassandra, Varric. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Probably won't even hear him talk. Oh, Scout Harding's in card is weird. My game being a bit weird. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a little nervous. I did I mention I started a human character? That's been really interesting. Oh, Cassandra looks here. so Let's good. Look around. I don't have the perk yet. I actually haven't paid too much attention to like the subtle differences yet, because I just really want to meet Blackwall and get that romance going. <laughs> Which is horrible. It's horrible. It should not be the way it goes. Did I... You don't have... Um... Shoot, let's get you an upgrade. Uh, you do... Wow. Enemies have a full draw immobilized. They are knocked brief... Or were knocked briefly... Oh my gosh, they fall asleep! I'm gonna say immobilize? Okay. Because if you hit something when it's asleep, it'll wake up. So we could do immobilized, or we could... Let's actually do that, because mine is the, the shrapnel version, you know? Cassandra... Spellshatter. Effect mage using magic using enemies with a demon. Deal a massive area damage when dispelling barriers and other beneficial effects on enemies. Ooh. Or we could get Blessed Blades. I like, yeah, maybe we'll get Blessed Blades. Or... Okay, so it stuns nearby enemies and damages demons. Let's do it. That's cool. Freaking... Cassandra looks so good in that armor. I'm never taking her out of it. Where am I going? The Grey Warden Alistair grew up at Red Yes, he did. He used to play in the um, this very village. Val Royal, Book Merchant. Not Val Royal. The freaking. What's the freaking? This place. Where I am at. Who's this? Do I. Did I not get you? I apologize, my friend. Ah, oh, Senna, my darling. For the first time in all these years, I've been... What world is this? The demon. I can take care of what it. I took flowers to your... I... Lethalan. You were Dalish. My... Her shrine lies on a hill to the west. Near this the game tent. seems like it was meant to be played... Stay safe. Walk in peace. ...by an elf. Like, it seems weird to Good not. Time. I don't know. I can buy... I can buy a Keeper Staff. Or I can... Oh, wait, um... Apprentice Coat and Apprentice Armor. He has a good selection and they're cheap. <laughs> Let's do... All those. <laughs> Freaking it. Why not? We could do... I, I might actually have a keeper. I can't sell, but I could... Firm bow grip. Ooh, I could do... Ooh, 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 ooh. It's probably tier one, or I could get the rugged bow grip. Ooh, uh, let's get the rugged bow grip. Firm bow grip. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I probably can't do anything to this bow because it's, um... 
it's a unique bow. But I, some of them you can. I remember with um, Heart... Heartseeker or something, the bow you get in uh, Jaws of a Con when you find uh, the where the lady died, where the mage lady died. Um, you get her bow, and I was able to add a rune to it. I think she already had one on there, but I changed it or something. I forgot about that, about customizing your bow, too. Flowers for Senna. can't wait to play this game with like a custom world state and like have like a bunch of little things like little callbacks to like Dragon Age Origins and 2 and stuff. It'll be cool. I kind of I wish I could play Talon with that too but it was too late. Um, Where did you learn to hammer? Craft not armor. Well okay let's craft maybe we'll craft um um, wait, okay, uh, do 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 not so Vivian, no, Dorian. Let's check out Dorian. Uh, is it gonna do anything? I don't know. I don't know if he can, whoa, have them now that I'm Oh. Maybe it does, but it takes away the armor, like the armored knee pads and puts in like I don't like those. What does it do to the arm? Oh, I kind of I think I like what it, I think it takes away one of his sleeve. It does. It takes away one of his sleeves. Four cloth, two leather, four leather, two cloth. Apprentice armor or apprentice coat. Looks like it doesn't really matter. Just depends on what you want. Uh, what about Vivian? <gasps> Holy crap! Oh my gosh! Vivian, we are making you some of these! It, oh, I hope she can wear them. Ever right. Holy shoot. Uh... Here, have some melee defense and uh, spear resistance. Yeah, sure. Okay. And then apprentice armor arms. Hopefully, you can wear this. Cold. We could do cold resistance. Sunder, no. Oh, okay. What was the what was the, I had that cotton? Um, no. Lamb's wool. Two percent magic defense. Nice. Heal bonus. Sure. Okay. Let's let's hope this worked. Serve the Lord. Vivian. I do, you can! Oh my gosh, this is a great day, Vivian! Oh my gosh, Vivian! Oh my gosh, you look so good! Oh my goodness! Look at that! She gonna kill you! Um, wait, let's actually see... What do I have right now that I... Can... Oh, I do have a... Oh wait, no, it came with it! Okay, the Masterwork Jagged Longbow Grip. Gives you plus nine constitution. Wait, what's that? What? Oh, okay, so we get... Okay. Do I have a rune? I do have a rune. Ooh. Let's go see if I can make any other runes. I don't think I actually have any um, empty runes. I could make a superb dragon slaying rune. Oh my gosh, you need six river poison glands? Shoot. Uh, damage versus a corrupted, damage versus the living, or fire damage. Ooh. Uh, 
I think I might just want to get like a um a fire rune. Okay, let's go downstairs and buy some runes. Real quick. I'll probably just buy a couple. I don't know how much money I have. <laughs> Maybe see what kind of uh if she has any rune rune uh Recipes. <laughs> Hiya! There's that guy. Uh, I don't need you, sister. I don't need you. Cause I'm a man. Two, three, four, six. Okay. Superb corrupting rune, a regular dragon slaying rune. I have giant spider glands, don't I? Um, what exactly does that do? Gimme, I don't care. I want it. I'll carry it back to Crestwood and kill those bandits. That's what father would. That's what he would have wanted. Oh man, I want to have both. <laughs> Wow. Oh. Wow. That is so expensive, though. 11,000. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Wow. <laughs> I want it! I like the stories behind some of these things, too. It's like the story that like makes half the reason I want it. Like, Certainty was like, the story behind it was awesome. And it looks freaking rad. Like, once I get that sword back, once I get that sword back, I ain't never taking it away. I'm gonna keep it, for, I don't care if anything, I don't care if I'm on freaking nightmare mode. The only thing I will trade it out for is when I make myself a dragon slaying sword. Like, I don't even care. I'll play Trespasser with it. Like, last time I didn't, and I wish I hadn't, like, I hadn't, like, given it away or stopped using it because I got... The weapon I got was pretty cool. But, still. I can make a Corrupting Rune or a Fire Rune. Let's make a Fire Rune. Yeah, okay. And let's put a fire rune on this, on uh, my freaking, Sir. my weapon. On Far Slayer. Let's do a rune. Yeah, fire! Fire! That looks rad. Oh my gosh. What's up, what does it say? Masterwork Jagged Longbow Grip. What would it look like without it? Doesn't change it. <laughs> it's supposed to change the way. Maybe it won't. Oh, I completed the quest. Yay. Maybe it won't, uh. Change. Oh. Ooh. Maybe play with that. 8% critical damage bonus. That could be nice. Oh, 12% critical damage bonus. No, that's... That's something I need. Ooh, ooh oh. Hmm. No, let's do the Bronto. Stagger armor penetration. Ooh, maybe. 7% attack? These numbers that are below. Oh, god damn it, bonus. Oh. Ooh. Let's do that. Okay. Let's see if I can put it on my weapon and have it change it how it looks. If not, I'll give it to Sarah. Does it? 
It looks really dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah, where's yours? I just need to remember maybe not to sell it. <laughs> She's using the ornate. It looked uh, actually didn't look too bad, but okay, she doesn't have a uh, room, but I ain't giving her one. Like, how would that even be, like, it would, like, poke you when you were trying to use it, you know? I think. But anyway, this has been a very long recording. Um, I'm gonna go eat. But thank you guys for joining me. It's been fun. I am hoping to stream this soon, but this weekend is bad because I have family visiting. So, yep. <laughs> Someday. <laughs> Someday soon it will happen. <laughs> But thank you guys again. I will see you in the next one.